At buildingit.ai, we're continuing our coverage of CES 2023 and everything AI and robotics. If you're enjoying our coverage, like and subscribe. The CES Innovation Awards are given to consumer products that demonstrate the highest design and engineering. The awards are across several categories and CES gives designation to each product in each category and CES gives designation to the highest rank honorees in each category. This year's CES Innovation Winners in Robotics. The first is a company called Aqua Robotics. They are a French robotics company, and that is Aqua, spelled A-C-W-A, but they are in the water. Their robot drives through pipelines in cities that are actually filled with water, that you don't have to drain the pipeline beforehand. And the robot is able to determine where there are leaks and breaks throughout the utility pipeline. That data is then sent back to the utility company and they can make a decision around which areas to prioritize for repairs. The next winner is a company called Agris Robotics. It's a Japanese farming robot that drives through farms and picks ripe bell peppers one at a time. Now this is different than some other harvesting systems that actually drive through the farm but will damage the tree as they are shaking some of the ripe vegetation off of it. Agris has a 12 hour battery lifespan and it has a Scala manipulator that picks the bell peppers off one at a time. It's not yet clear to me how Agris is so different from some of the other robot manufacturers of harvesting platforms that we've seen out there, but I'm looking forward to delving in a little bit further as we hear more about this company. And here's a look at some of the other harvesting agricultural robots that are currently on the market. Get out the way, Kylie. There's a new company in town. It's called the Mori Pacific, which is a Korean-based company that has built a platform that will create a makeup tone that matches your skin color perfectly. More Pacific has come up with a new line of cosmetics called Authentic Color Master by Tonework. The cosmetics are manufactured to meet the needs of each customer. Tonework uses AI algorithms to precisely analyze the tone of the face. It then uses robotics to make custom liquid foundation, cushion foundation, and lip products. A two-armed ABB Yumi robot is used by the system to automatically mix and make the custom cosmetic product for each client. Our fourth honoree is another Korean company, actually a spin-out out of Samsung called Evar, that is developing a robot product called Parky. Parky is essentially a mobile battery pack that can be summoned to an EV owner anywhere in a parking lot. The owner still needs to connect and disconnect Parky to their vehicle. Parky is expected to be sold to the public next year, and it is likely that it will be sold in countries where there is less regulation. Are you enjoying our coverage of CES 2023? If so, let us know in the comments below, and also let us know of what you thought of this year's honorees of the CES Innovation Award in Robotics. Until next time.